Hi, Al of Hanksters of Daytona, Daytona Beach, Florida. Uh, special guest today, we got a 1972 Chevrolet Cheyenne pickup truck, 1972. Gorgeous, gorgeous truck, real gentleman's truck here. Um, drive line is really exceptional. It has a throttle body, 454, cast iron manifolds. The entire assembly looks like it came out of the 1990 uh, SS pickup truck has turbo 400 transmission with it has power steering power brakes air conditioning a huge aluminum four pass radiator on it uh, the lines are all new everything's polished everything's chromed uh, the car is just an exceptional exceptional car two electric cooling fans Underneath the hood is done like the top. It's painted high gloss black. It's a metal hood instead of being fiberglass like a lot of guys put on. The fender wells are high gloss also like the rest of the finish on this car. It's a great looking vehicle. Um, fantastic running. Absolute fantastic running. All your hoses are new. All your wiring is new. Chrome valve pan covers. Chrome alternator, chrome power brake assembly, chrome master cylinder, air cleaner tops, chrome. What isn't chrome is stainless steel and polished. It's a fantastic looking vehicle. Really a great vehicle. Okay, hood's closed and you can see the fit and finish of the car is just exemplary. Um, power induction hood scoop on the uh, metal hood. Everything is either chromed or finely polished stainless steel around the vehicle. Um, billet aluminum grill in the vehicle. Marker lights are amber, parking lights. Chrome on the front bumper is absolutely fantastic. The gaps around the hood are just as nice and clean and straight as should be. Like I said, the fitment of the hood is as nice as you'd ever find. Absolutely gorgeous. Front end of the vehicle is straight, nice, very, very high grade, 1972 Cheyenne pickup truck. Going down the driver's side, you can see the side marker lights. Everything is nice and clean and fresh on them. Uh, V8, 454, fuel injected. Like I said, throttle body fuel injection. No trouble at all starting this guy. Um, wheel lips are nice. Transition from the front fender to the door is nice. Uh, back of the hood fitment to the cowl area is just as great as can be. Tinted front windshield, correct uh, uh, wiper arms. 18 inch chrome torque thrust style wheels on the vehicle with a high grade tire on them. Cheyenne C10 designation on the uh, front fender. Two rear view mirrors on the doors left and right. Um, Whiskers on the top of the doors are as nice as can be. The rubbers around your vent windows are all fresh and clean. Nice and soft and pliable. Uh, great looking car. Door handles real deep in chrome. Everything fits like it should. Uh, you get inside the car. Gauge cluster is all nice and freshly chromed. The gas pedal is nice and chromed the way it should be, the outline. Uh, door handles, window cranks, the interior of this car is just exemplary, it's fantastic. And it does have air conditioning. Cab corners are nice, no issues at all with them. Tinted glass the whole way around this car, smoke glass on the back window. Uh, the bed of course is just a, a, absolutely is new, there's no marks or anything on it. It's just a, a beautiful, beautiful fit and finish on it. Of course, the, the bed uh, size would be fiberglass as opposed to steel. Same thing, 18 inch torque thrust style wheel in the back, a little different offset, a little fatter tire. Uh, side of the vehicle is laser straight. Paint's just a foot deep. It's black. You don't see any defects. You don't see any deviations in the vehicle. Very, very high quality, very, very high quality car. You know, the back of the uh, tailgate, everything is nice and smooth. Uh, really a great fit. No issues at all with it. And like I said, nice stainless steel. Um, roll tip uh, dual exhaust system out the back. Um, appears to be either oiled or stained uh, oak 
flooring in the uh, bed with stainless steel uh, dividers in them. Uh, everything done to the nth degree on this vehicle. Inside the bed, around the vehicle, everything is as nice as can be. Back end is very smooth, very custom looking, no dense things. Very nice looking vehicle. Okay, going down the uh, passenger side, same as the driver's side. Everything is just as smooth and nice as can be. The finish on this vehicle is just absolutely beautiful. When you have a vehicle that's painted So much for that guy, huh? When you have a vehicle that's painted black and you don't see any deviations or any imperfections in the paint, you know someone's done a really great job and was very conscientious about how they painted it and how they finished this vehicle. Uh, tires, like I say, are all new. Uh, the cab is just as nice and great fitting as you could possibly get. You see the interior is just gorgeous. You know, your sills are all finely polished. Headliner is gorgeous in it. The seat is black. Uh, everything on this vehicle is black without uh, uh, anything other than chrome accents, just making everything jump out at you. Great looking vehicle. Again, passenger side rear view mirror, which is a great added uh, feature to any vehicle. Door is smooth, nice as can be. Going down the side. Same thing, Cheyenne 10 on the uh, passenger side front. There's no deviations on any of the paintwork on this car. No dents, no marks, no scuffs. It's as nice a vehicle as you ever find. Um, it's a real gentleman's truck. It's not something you're going to use as uh, just a plain old pickup truck. It's a, it's a very custom, high grade, high quality vehicle with an incredible drive line in it. Um, it, it. It's not something that you're going to find a duplicate to. It's just the way the, the thing is put together, the way everything is assembled, the appointments, all the chrome that has been used to just accentuate all the black on the car. Um, it just makes this thing stand out every part of the truck is, is, is made to stand out. Um, it's, it's a vehicle that you're going to have a hard time duplicating and it's available here at Hangsters. Okay, we're underneath our 1972 454 fuel injected pickup truck. Uh, this thing's just absolutely gorgeous underneath. New springs, new shocks, new front rotors, new front brake hardware, new front calipers, all new stainless steel brake lines, functional parking brake, all new, all new cables, all new hardware. Uh, you can see there's no oil leaks at all in this vehicle anywhere. Turbo 400 transmission, again no oil leaks, everything nice and clean and fresh as can be. Floor pans are absolutely gorgeous, two and a quarter inch uh, uh, pipes on the vehicle. It has some undercarriage lights that uh, I was unaware of, but we do have undercarriage lights here that apparently you can put on from up uh, in the cab. Give it a little pop at night whenever you're going down the road or parked at the uh, uh, parking lot. Uh, new drive shaft, new U-joints, new speedometer cable. The floor pans are absolutely gorgeous. They're, they're original and they're not rusted or deteriorated in any way. Uh, the uh, rocker panels are fine, the structural supports. The frame itself is just as clean and crisp as can be. You see all the rivets are all nice on it. The uh, frame itself has no scale. Um, it's just a real straight truck underneath. Very, very nice straight truck. Swing arms going toward the back are uh, rust free, nice and clean. Just a nice looking rig. Fuel line is stainless steel also coming from the back. Uh, all the lines on this vehicle, brake and fuel, are all brand new stainless. Okay, our two and a quarter inch pipes uh, go into two Flowmaster uh, high performance mufflers. Two and a quarter inch pipes out the back. Uh, again, new springs in the back of our vehicle. Brand new shocks in the back also. Heavy duty 12 bolt uh, rear end. Uh, drum brakes in the back, fin uh, uh, drums heavy duty. Undercarriage in the back is just as straight and nice as can be. Everything is clean. Uh, hoses are all fresh coming off the uh, gas tank. The tank itself has no dents or marks or anything in it. Uh, the the uh, rolled stainless tips going off the uh, uh, 
dual exhaust system or stainless steel and, and they're just as gorgeous and nice as it can be. It's a really nice straight truck underneath. Uh, good running vehicle. I drove it. It does absolutely nothing wrong. Um, it is fuel injected. No having to worry about carburation problems or ignition problems or anything. It has an HEI system on it. Truck runs out absolutely spectacular. It's a great, great vehicle. Somebody's going to have a lot of fun with it.